assalamu alaikum welcome to medicine by chips today our topic is rbc count first of all we will discuss about its apparatus uh, so first of all we have hemocytometer uh, this is used uh, in the rbc count first of all uh, we have the rbc pipette which is used to suck the blood and uh, mix the contents and there is a cover slip as you can see it's clear and there is a new bar chamber which is used to count the rbcs here is another tube which is known as wbc pipette in this uh, procedure we also need blood so we have a, a pricking needle and cotton gauze uh, we will count the rbcs in the compound microscope uh, the solution used in it uh, there are mainly three solutions which are used in this process one is called hans fluid and the, the other is a dessis solution and the other is normal saline uh today we have normal saline here take the solution uh, because we are using saline so we will take it uh, 2 ml of the saline solution uh, the next step is to choose the uh, to focus the newbar chamber under the microscope we will focus the newbar chamber at 10x here we place the newbar chamber and we are going to focus it after uh, we have done the fine focus on the newbar chamber we will take it out for charging it with the blood uh, we will take the blood of the patient uh, first of all we take the consent of the patient assalam alaikum uh, my name is hussain ajmal i am first year mba student uh, today my i will uh, do rbc count and uh, for that i will need uh, blood for of you okay first of all we will take the middle finger and uh, we will sterilize it with the cotton gauze then we will we will prick his finger with a with this pricking needle the blood uh, then we will suck the blood with the rbc pipette we will place it on the blood and we have to uh, suck it to the 0.5 level then we will take hand fluid or the saline that we have now uh, and we will fill it to the 101 level at the rbc pipette now it is at the 101 level so we will mix it for 2 to 3 minutes and wait for it to mix, uh, mix completely we suck the blood to the this level this is 0.5 and the saline solution or the other solution which we, we will use in this process this is the 101 level we will suck it to the, this level and mix it the contents for 2 to 3 minutes and uh, uh, if you are using hand fluid then we will uh, just wait for 3 to 4 uh, minutes for that but uh, now we are using the saline solution so we will wait for 1 hour after 1 hour we are back uh, and uh, we uh, for the, doing the experiment further on we will have to discard the first few drops of the solution now we will charge the fluid uh, on the newbar chamber for that purpose we will place the newbar chamber under the microscope now we will charge it and uh, cover it with the cover slip now we will place the cover slip very carefully now we will wait for further 3 to 4 minutes so that the cells and the fluid settle down under the uh, cover slip now after 3 or 4 minutes we will count the rbcs in the newbar chamber Mm-hmm. 
we will uh, move on to the 40 x for proper view of the RBCs. Now we are going to count the RBCs in the upper right corner or this uh, you can count in the center of the smallest square 16 smallest squares. Now we are going to count the second uh, rule for counting RBCs is the uh, Thomas rule. In this rule uh, we leave lower and the left border and we do not count RBCs present at this border or uh, which uh, are present at uh, other than this border we will count RBCs on that. Uh, for the calculation uh, we have calculated the RBCs in the 80 small squares those are 450 RBCs and uh, for one uh, small square number of RBCs will be 450 or 80 and number of cells in 1 over 4000 volume this will goes 450 multiplied by 4000 over 80 and this comes 20400. Uh, as uh, explained in the uh, principle the dilution factor is 200 times and uh, so we will multiply the uh, number of RBCs with the dilution factor and we will have the total number of RBCs. Number of cells in 1 millimeter cube of diluted blo uh, blood this comes 20,400 multiplied by dilution factor that is 200 and uh, it comes uh, uh, 4.5 million per millimeter cube and uh, it is uh, in the normal range. We will discuss about the principle of the uh, uh, this procedure the RBC count. And the principle is that the, we have to dilute the blood uh, uh, to the 200 times and then uh, we will count the RBCs it depends on the dilution factor that is 200. Uh, we can count by multiplying the RBCs counted in the newer chamber by multiplying it with the uh, dilution factor that is 200 times.